You also uh, are very involved in the Death Race franchise. I know Universal has a Death Race movie coming out uh, at the end of this year, I believe. I think I asked you last time I spoke to you about how it had gone, and you said to me you had just seen a rough cut. So have you seen an another cut of the Death Race? Yeah, the Death Race Inferno is finished um, in terms of the cutting process. Um, the director, Rule René, is just grading it right now. And actually on the plane on the way down to San Diego, I got a whole bunch of stills from his grade. It looks fantastic. I and mean, it's really, it's a really cool, cool look. And I think that's a franchise that, um, you know, f for a straight-to-DVD movie, really delivers. I mean, come on, that cast. I mean, Danny Trejo, Ving Rhames, I mean, all in the same movie. It's just phenomenal. Well, for, can you tell people, how does this Death Race fit into the other ones that have been made? Is it a prequel? Is it a sequel? How, can you tell people a little bit about it? Um, well... Obviously, the first movie that I directed, the idea was it was a prequel to Roger Corman's movie. Then Death Race 2 was a prequel to my movie, which was a prequel to Roger Corman's movie. And Death Race Inferno is a sequel to Death Race 2, but a prequel to my movie. You, you, no, you can understand. Hopefully that makes sense it in makes a total sense. recall kind of way. No, totally. It totally makes sense to me, but I think for like the average person, because you guys have played with time like that, it's sort of a little more complicated, which is why I wanted to make sure it was people oops, understand exactly what was going on. It just kicks ass, and this time it's in the desert. Yeah, and the, and the trucks and the cars are just bigger and better than ever. The destructions are bigger. I mean, it's a, it's a really fun movie. Um, I have to wrap with you really soon, but we're all